Hi guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the show. It's Beaker's Lab. The gang is back. Hey man, uh, if you guys follow along, you know, we just maxed our main base. Looks like we're about to get an update. Let's check this thing out. Hey, by the way, you guys see this apprentice builder thing? It's somehow like the clock tower from the builder base, but worse, and it costs gems. If it upgraded with dark elixir or gold or elixir or something, that'd be another story. But the fact that it's gems, that, that's that's a tough look, man. That's a tough look. Why didn't they just take the clock tower from the builder base, put it over here? That thing is great. It's, it's great. Anyway. Yo, I just noticed, is this the first dark barracks that's actually, it looks like it's made out of stone instead of, there's like no wood left on this thing. I like that, that's pretty cool. It's not wood anymore, it's not a, it's not a hut, it's like a cave. Cave is probably the right term too because this dude is a druid and if you guys are into like, you know, nerdy, you know, Dungeons and Dragons stuff, like I just played Baldur's Gate 3 earlier this year. Halson, he's a druid, he can change into a bear. And you can uh, date him as a bear. That was that was big on TikTok. Okay, these guys look so mean when they turn into the bear. The face is weird though. The face is freaking me out a little bit. Well, guys, let's get these things max. Let's see what they can do. What do we want to heal with them? I mean, maybe a queen or something. Wait, this is the most expensive thing in the game. Three hundred and seventy-five thousand dark elixir. That's definitely the most expensive thing in the game now, right? I don't think there's anything that much. Cool. <laughs> 140 heal, 1600 hit points. Look at a healer. I mean, similar, honestly, the druid is better in a lot of ways, but he's got that feature where he gets angry and turns into a bear. This is gonna be the interesting one, man. If you try to heal, I mean, giant healer or Pekka's or Yeti's or anything like that, is this the way? Like, is this what we're gonna wanna do? I mean, maybe even hog riders. Here we go. That's so crazy. Wait, skeleton spell, you're failing me, bro. What are you doing? Oh, that's so sick. Look, they're like all helping each other. There's three different types of healers here. Very cool, very cool. Wait, you know what I don't even know? What happens if you just drop one? Okay. Do they get angry? They do. So for some reason you wanted them to just turn into a bear without doing anything. I mean, you can do that too. All right, let's get them all down though. What's up guys? How we doing? Okay, I know this is a bad example because they just went through the gauntlet of splash damage. But they are having trouble keeping up. Still though, I think this is gonna be like, with a balanced breakfast of rage and heal spells, I think this is actually gonna work with hogs. I really do. All right guys, so we're coming up to these air defense here. Let's see if the warden can survive. An air warden walk. Well, I mean, don't count this. Like don't, that's obviously gonna kill him. Oh my God, he's. Oh, he finally hit his ability. Oh my God, look at that. They're keeping up with an entire max air defense. That's pretty cool, man. That's a lot of healing. That's pretty cool. Hey, do you guys think we could out heal a single Inferno? Look, I brought one of them all the way down to level one, so it's gonna be a little bit easier, but check this out. All right, I don't want, hang on. I just gotta get them to the defense first. Okay, perfect. Oh my God. Oh my. <laughs> that was one of the coolest things I've ever seen in Clash. Guys, you think about an Inferno Tower as like once it gets warmed up, like good night, you know, there's, there's no way to stop it except to, for freezing it. I cannot believe that worked. We almost had it too. We almost, <laughs> oh my God, that was so fun. Okay, the, <laughs> there's, there's been some confusion here, guys. What are you doing? Man, this is so much healing. Like, it's really cool. I, I really like this. Hey, so what happens if we clone? Oh, I wanted to clone one of the druids before they changed just to see, but looks like we just got more bears. It's all right. Well, guys, let us know what you think about this. I think the bears are cool, but it's really just like, you know, with like a golem when it turns into the golemites, 
I mean, you're not using a golem for the golemites, really. You're using it because it's got a lot of health. I think you're using this for the heal. If these things jumped walls, I would like them a lot more. I think that would really make this something. But basically, these things are just giants. So, cool. Hang on, let me try one more thing. I took out the, the mini warden just to see if he was distracting maybe too much. Heal as well. Wait, that was it? Wait, it was the mini warden. The mini warden was messing it up the whole time. We've achieved equilibrium. Look at this. Wait, wait, keep the rage, keep the rage. No, 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 no. I cannot believe that these can keep up with a single inferno. Yeah, it's level one. I don't know if you can keep up with level two. Ah, oh, now we gotta try max. Now we've gotta try max. All right, all right. One second. All right, I'm gonna drop a heal spell just to get a little bit extra. You know what, let's drop two heal spells. Hey, how about three? Have we done it? Oh, the single, the max single Inferno is just too much, man. You're never gonna be able to keep up with this thing. But the fact that you can keep up with it for that long, insane, man, insane. Hey, we love you guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. I really did like this as a sneak peek. I mean, any new offense, offense is king, man. I'm always saying like, if we're gonna have an update, if it's gonna be defensive heavy or offensive heavy, I'd rather see the offense. So hope you guys have enjoyed it. Let us know if you did in the comments below. Everything else is max. So as soon as this is in the game, I mean, let's get this thing, guys. Anyway, that's it for me today. I'm gonna edit this and get it out to you guys. And we'll see you right here next time. Oh, and by the way, I think you might be seeing this on Father's Day, right? Happy Father's Day. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be uh, seeing my family today. So hope you guys have a good day as well. We'll see you tomorrow right here on Beaker's Lab.